I hope you're ready. Because it's time to game. You get to watch the loading stream while we wait. It's time. It is time. It's pit time. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> also, Puma and Angelica, thank you for the resubs, but little Tika, thank you for the bits. I appreciate that. Anyway, we got we got big plans. Big plans for the next three hours. Yeah, all of the old Sims games had intros like that, Marissa. Um, you can skip them, but I like to watch them. Yeah, The Sims 4, I don't know why The Sims 4 doesn't have an intro like that. I would, I would love that. If they had some like, I don't know, have some like drama between Bob and Eliza or something. Maybe he like falls over with his pancakes. It could be cute. They should do one. They've got a really good trailer team. Maybe a Sims 4 trailer. Oh, Jake, you're fine. Don't worry. It's not a big deal. <laughs> it's not a big deal. We just tell people not to tag me in the Discord because like, what you did is no problem. Don't worry. It was like one time. But people have a tendency to like see that I'm in the server or that my friends are in the server and be like, oh my god, hi, Atlils. And then if people did that like 20 times a day, then I would have so many Discord notifications. So it's, it's more of just like a, you know, if it's not important, don't just at me to say hi, you know? But like, if you have something you want to show me, that's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. You didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's just like people have a tendency to like spam at me and my friends and I don't want my friends to get harassed. More so it's my friends. Like, it, cause like, listen, you can't get like Vixella to leave the Discord server. You get it. <laughs> well, you didn't do it, but you know. <laughs> oh wait, Olive, really? You've not been looking at the pictures? That's really exciting. I hope that you like it. I actually haven't changed mine yet. Maybe I'll change it now. My calendar is on the next month. Goodbye, January. Maybe I should show you. Do you wanna see? Do you wanna see? February. My cat hated this. <laughs> it was, there was one photo. I'm not even joking. There was one photo, one. The rest, well, there was, there was a spam of photographs taken in about 20 seconds. <laughs> And that was the extent to which my cat was ready for that. <laughs> but anyway, um, my birthday better be on your calendar. Oh, Tori, that's an, an interesting thing to point out. So um, I don't know how to tell you this, but mine is, is yours? Add me, add me, I, I write it in. <laughs> I could. I haven't written on that calendar. I've just been having it hung up. Um, Heather and Jen and Emma and Amy and Cass and Sophie and Morgan and Lisa and Fluffy and Olive and Sarah and Kylie and Phantom and Hannah and Pink Sprinkles and Little Tika. Thank you all for the subs and bits. Wait, there are no mod birthdays on the calendar? Could you imagine, though, if I actually put the mod birthdays on the calendar? Picture this. I'm like, <laughs> it's Mrs. Tomato's birthday. And then all my YouTube channel is like, who? <laughs> Who? <laughs> They're like, Toma tomato? <laughs> we should have done it. I should have done it. No, Dan's isn't on there. It's just my birthday and the pet's birthdays. Um, Like my cat's birthday, the dog's birthdays, those are all in there. Even the lizard's birthday's in there. Oh my god, speaking of the lizard, no, you won't believe this. You won't believe this. My mom was... <laughs> My mom worked from home today, um, and <laughs> my sister just sent me a picture of my mom in a Zoom call with the lizard on her shoulder. She literally was on a Zoom call, face cam on, with the lizard on her shoulder. <laughs> she did a Zoom call with the lizard. My sister has a bearded dragon called Nova, and she, <laughs> she did the Zoom call with him. <laughs> Something about that just really gets me. I love that. I love it. I bet like everybody else in the call loved it too. Cause he just like hangs out, you know? He was just sitting there. <laughs> I can see you, Shan, I can see you. Um, but anyway, it was it made me it made me giggle. It's it really is a power move though. <laughs> but if I had a Zoom call with somebody who had a lizard, I would be so pleased. <laughs> that would like make my day. <laughs> Um, Catherine, it's good to see you. I hope you feel better. Um, and happy, happy birthday. Can I sing you a song? Also, um, Ruby and Mai and Ella and Mam and Morgan and Katsu and everybody, thank you for the subs. Ellie, thank you for the raid also. Hello. 
<laughs> yeah, that's the thing also, Heather, where, like, you can probably picture my mom's co-workers. They probably were like, you won't believe it. Like, <laughs> somebody on my call today had a lizard. <laughs> like, they probably told their families, you know? <laughs> like, something about that is just really amusing to me. Anyway, anyway, I would. I'd be like, mom, guess what? <laughs> somebody on my call today had a lizard on their shoulder. <laughs> Sue, Ghost, Beth. Uh, Ghosty and Jay and Stinky and Tori and, and Sadie and Catherine and Ruby and everybody. Thank you for the subs. Kimmy as well. Um, did I miss anything else? Lisa, Lilac, Heather? Thank you so much. Okay. Um, well, we're gonna play Sims Medieval today. Um, oh, that's right. We're in the middle of a quest. I have, I have to keep, I have to continue it. Um, but let me, let me talk, let me talk to you all a little bit about Sims Medieval, if you're new to the, the game. Um, the game's not new. <laughs> this game came out in 2011, okay? Um, it is an official Sims game, it's a, it's a real Sim, it's not like a mod or anything, it's a separate game. It's a spin-off of The Sims 3. Um, you don't need to have The Sims 3, it's not like The Sims 3. It runs on The Sims 3's engine though, so it looks like The Sims 3. Um, but this is a separate spin-off game, it's 20 bucks, it is on Origin, you can still buy it. And it's like a quest game, kind of? Like, basically you you have this like medieval kingdom, and you play as the, the queen first, and then you do some quests and stuff, and you slowly unlock, like, unlock different buildings, and then you can be like, the, the doctor, and you can be like, the, you know, other people in the town and, like, do quests as them, too. Um, and it's just really fun. It's, it's really dumb. There's a lot of funny things. There's, it's kind of morbid. Like, you can literally die sword fighting in this game. Don't try it. I did that. It was bad. I didn't realize when, when it said, like, battle to the death that they were serious, but they were, and I died. Um, you can also, as the queen, you can send people to death if you wish. You can send them to be literally eaten alive by a, a beast in a pit. I'm not even kidding. I'm dead serious. Um, this game is hilarious. <laughs> so, um, I hope that you like it. I think if you give it a chance, I think you will like it, truly. Um, but anyway, it's it's great fun. So, um, I hope that it's it's it'll be fun for you to get to see. Um, Maya and Oat Milk and Straub and Ruthless and Maid and Mister and Starling with a thousand bits and Jenny and Gianna and, and uh, Mangy and Squishy and Horny for Bees and every time <laughs> and we need them bad and Maya everybody thank you for the subs um am I killing sims today besties well I'm currently on a quest I'm I'm forging the badges of trading I need to figure that out actually although I don't know if I'm awake yet um oh you're fully rested oh good okay make me some food then little one let's eat oh your red cardigan arrived oh nice hope that's exciting it's a good day all right, I, I need to make, what did it say? She wants me to make a f badge of trading. My focus is to, oh, shoot. Oh, that's right, I'm having a dry spell. <sighs> I'm feeling the effects of not having kissed or woohooed in a while, so I need to get Amber some action. <laughs> okay, um, so. I need to do something to fix this problem. Look, I don't know. It's kind of concerning. I agree. But that's what it says. She knows what she wants. <laughs> no, it's kind of scary. Also, Jetpack and Lady Bird and Sylvia and Tay and Lily, thank you all for the subs. The queen did have her baby live. Yeah, the queen's baby- there's not toddlers in this game, so the queen's baby's actually already a child, even. Should I- this guy's a good man. Should I- I don't know, just a thought. <laughs> Maybe we could date. Oh, wait, what about this guy? Shane. Mm. Nah, I like this one better. Maybe I'll try and woo. Just like casually though, you know? Not like anything fancy, I'll just, just a little bit. It's pretty easy to make them like you. You just gotta be careful first before you do anything too much, you know? So I'll do this. I need to get him to like me better. 
So Sims 4 isn't the only game that didn't have toddlers? Yeah, well this game, this game, I, you don't really need toddlers in this game. I w even the kids you can't do much as. Even the kids are kind of useless, so I, I understand that there's no toddlers. Oh, he's vain! Oh, you're gonna love me. Here. Praise his looks. No, no, come back! Come back! Bad man. I'm trying to fix my dry spell! God. Anyway. <laughs> Hop and Vivo and Cavo and Jade and Wendy and Totally and, and Dennis and Sylvia, thank you for the subs. This game does run well for being 10 years old. You're absolutely right. Um, I, I'm with you on that. What? Alright, I lost my guy. Should I pick this guy instead? I don't know. Let's just try. Let's just try. <laughs> is that the queen's kid? No, I don't think so. Oh my god, it literally is! <gasps> it's Princess Astrid! This is the first time I've seen her since she aged up! Oh my god, there's stars in our midst. I should be friendly to her. I think that's, like, actually important, to be honest. Astrid is friendly. That's good. Why are there so many kids out? Don't you guys have school? Look, there's, like, four of them here. Oy. Okay, well. I'm gonna try and talk to this guy, because he's here, and I think that I'll be- I'll- it'll be easy for me to- to date him. Because I don't think he'll leave, because he works here. Oh my gosh! Fight, 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 fight. There is a medieval Sims, yes. Oh, it's the king! <sighs> no pressure. Fashionista Harvey? Forget it, forget it, forget it, forget it. This is the one, this is the one, this is the one. I'm dating him instead. Sorry to keep changing my mind, but... This is the one. <laughs> this is absolutely the one. 100%. No, wait, rough house. Oh. Fashionista Harvey won a rough house test of strength. Okay. Hmm. Anyway, I want to try and date him. I like him. I think he's very attractive. And I would like for him to date me. Does this count as getting- where's my- we learned that he's vain too? Ask to court. Wait, he left! Because you want to watch the sword fighting? That's fine, I get it. I do. Oh, we are courting. Okay, don't worry. Should I try and kiss him? Oh, <gasps> yes! Oh, fixed! Okay, now I'm in a great mood. Okay. Um, I can leave him. So anyway, we need to get back to our quest. Um, for our quest, we have a lot of work to do. Um, with, like, forging badges of trading and whatnot, so, um... I need to get a move on. I just had to kiss him so she would stop complaining about her lack of action. Um, but maybe I'll also try and successfully mine three times. Because I would like- I need the- I need the stuff anyway. This is fine. This will be good. Her dry spell's over though. <laughs> Congrats. Okay, we got some stuff. Let's go home. Because now we need to work on crafting. Hey everybody! Okay. Forge the badge of trading. Badge of trading. Oh, we have the stuff. Easy! Okay, cool. Cool! <laughs> Kristen! Pancake! Shannon! Iris! Elizabeth! Doctor! Talisha! Lily! Uh, show! Thank you all for the subs, everybody. Come on. Get it forged. Anyway, so, like, in this quest, um, obviously I'm playing as, like, the blacksmith. Um, 
Cutie, so you aren't only one person. You play as, like, multiple characters over the course of a, lo a long amount of time. Um, you aren't only the queen. You play as, like, the queen, and then you do a different quest to somebody else, and then you go back to the queen. You, you know, there's, like, lots of different quests and lots of different characters. Um, I have been- I have the most fun playing the queen so far, so I've been playing her a lot, but speak of her, she's right there. Um... How should I contribute? I can make a handful of hammers and donate them to the kingdom, or I've got money to spare. Honestly, just pay up. Yeah, give the queen the simoleons, because I don't really want to- where is she? Queenie! Huh. Well, I normally handle the ordering of the building around here. You can help the building effort, though. The kingdom is always in need of money and tools, and you could donate either. Why, it just so happens that I have 250 simoles right here. I'll pass these along to the queen and get that building started. Oh, I need to move my face down. Hang on. I forgot I moved my face down for this. Anyway, this is not what I had in mind when I came to conquer architecture, but helping the cause is enough for my mastery, I guess. Oh, wow, wow. Oh, there she is. I just didn't see it because it was blocked. I don't really care about you doing things the right way. Just pay up. Okay, I need to forge the next badge. Craft the badge of architecture. Okay, that's fine. Anyway, that's the plan. Is it a game you can finish or does it go on forever? To be honest, Bestie, uh, I don't think it goes on forever. I think there's like a, a, a amount of quests that will eventually end. But, um... You can play with, like, multiple different- I'm too hungry to do that right now. Okay. You can play with, like, multiple different people, um, over a long amount of time. Like, I can kill off the queen if I want to. I'm gonna buy some seeds so I can make some- oops. So I can make some better food, because I'm sick of eating my sad food. I only have two hours left to do that, but I'm not gonna- I simply won't. Okay, let's make some seed soup. Anyway, um, I don't really know what happens, but you can kill off the queen. There's like a whole quest to kill off the queen and then their heir is the next one. It's great fun. Um, but anyway. <laughs> Horny for peace, thanks for the bits, and Daisy, and Andromeda, and Peace, and Jamie, and Liz, and Pancake, and Kirsten, thank you all for the subs. Um, never have I ever seen this game in my life. Rose, it's hilarious. You'll see. You'll soon understand. You'll know exactly what I'm talking about. Alright, let's go forge the, the badge of architecture or whatever. I already have all my electrum that I need. I'm doing great. It's not a mod, Mrs. It's not a mod. Everybody always thinks it's a mod. This is a real official spin-off of The Sims that came out in 2011. It is a real game. You can buy it on Origin if you want it. <laughs> I successfully forged a normal quality badge of architecture. The next art to learn is tailoring. I don't know much about sewing, but I do understand forging. Perhaps some metal clothes will capture the villagers' imaginations. Ooh. Forge three iron masks. All right, I'll do that in the morning. Yes, The Sims made it. That's what I mean when I say official Sims spinoff. <laughs> it is a real Sims spinoff. A lot of the people that made this game still work at EA. You know, like, Sim Guru Ninja? He worked on The Sims Medieval back in the day. Um, keep in mind, it's like 11 years old, but it came out in 2011. It is a real game. <laughs> it's not a mod, it's a real game. <laughs> it's really fun, though. I think you'll like it. Oh, sore from being puny and all my physical exertion? That's okay, I get it. I know, I know where you're coming from. I really do. What, did I use all my seeds up? I thought I bought loads of seeds. What the heck? That's annoying. Wait, did you just eat? I think Sandra just ate my food. What the heck? I think it's because she was sitting there. That's rude. <laughs> Who does that? Okay, I wanted to make a metal mask or whatever it said. Iron mask. There you go. That's easy. I also need to repair the pirate's rowboat and fix and deliver a broken sword. Ugh. Ugh. No, they don't have normal needs. She only has to eat and sleep. See, someone said, how is this game more detailed than The Sims 4? Bestie, um, 
it's different than The Sims 4. It's It's got like a quest element that is more detailed than The Sims 4, but you know, I only need to eat and sleep. <laughs> Have you seen The Sims 4? I really- this game is very, very surface level. I would like to see a- a, um, a remake of this though, to be honest with you. I would love to see, like, a, an updated spin-off of The Sims. That would be hilarious. Alright, this is my third iron mask. I'm almost done forging it. There we go. Give mask to fashionista?! I have the masks, now I need some guinea pigs to see how fashionably visible they are. Well, I'm dating the fashionista! One of the fashionistas. I think there's three fashionistas. I have to give them to all of them, but I'm dating one of the fashionistas! Oh, you live in the queen's house? Oh, this is very exciting for me. I love getting to see the fashionistas. How do I f repair the pirate's rowboat? Can I do that here? I'm not sure. I might come collect these first though, just cause that's more fun for me. It's so dot 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 metal. <laughs> Thank you fashionista, that is that is really helpful. <laughs> oh, it's at the forge? Oh, that's easy then. You need to make the boat? Oh. Discovered a gem deposit. Alright. Let's go give a mask to the last fashionista, who is also my boyfriend. I'm ready. Run faster, run faster, run faster. Anyway, how's your day been, everybody? Where is he? Yeah, that's what I thought. Finally, headgear that makes a real statement. I have no shame. Marvelous. The fashionistas really loved the masks. One of them even gave me a memento to show them a fantastic designer. Okay. Maybe I'll craft it. I don't know. That could be fun. This task is very long. <laughs> Let me see about... Maybe I'll go back home and repair the pirate's rowboat. That could be fun. Um... Jace as good as it can be. Nice. Nice. Um, something about- oh, repaired rowboat. Okay. I'll stream until 7 probably. Yeah, crazy bot. That's the plan. That is the plan. I need to return the repaired rowboat to the owner. I need to go do that before it runs away though. I mean, I have 14 hours left to do that, so. Fix and deliver broken sword. I don't think I'll do that. I'll just do one task per day. That's more important to me. <laughs> that's- that's better for me, I think. I'm- I'm more capable of that. I made a candy life buoy. Normal day. Oh! Right. Yeah. <laughs> Happy thanks for 24 months! El Scott and Sleepy and Jake and Cute and Ashy and Desert, thank you for the subs. Miss Slim Shady too and Lost in Milky Way and AJ and Planty and BM, everybody, thank you so much. Um, you got accepted into five out of the six master's programs you applied to there in England? Nice! That is huge! Congratulations! That is really, really exciting. Um, this is the only game I'm gonna play today, yes. Simia, so, yeah, we've been planning this for like a week. <laughs> give, give her a chance! I think you might like it. After a lot of hard work, Journeyman Smith Amber Jill successfully forged a normal quality badge of tailoring. Most of the badges are done, warfare is next, and often associated with hunting. Through hunting I can get meat, and through agriculture I get grains. Together I can use those ingredients to complete my badge of cooking as well. It's all coming together. Oh my god, fine. I'm going to sleep first though, we can deal with that in the morning. Yikes. Uh, Jasmine, so if you look in your chat settings, the little gear icon, you'll see um, a thing that says chat filters. There's like a series of chat filters you can change, and you can turn them off that way. Um, it's like in your own settings, in your own chat filters that are going to do that, unfortunately. Um, Madison doesn't hear back from some of them until March, then she has to decide in April, and our lease is up in May. Gonna be fun. 
That's speedy, Hope. <laughs> that is speedy. Do you know, like, I know obviously Madison's gotten into a couple of the ones she applied to, but does she, has she heard back about, like, funding yet for any of those? Uh, you probably would have told me if she had. But obviously that's a big, um, <laughs> a big part of that one. <laughs> so... No, not yet. Not any of them. Oh, it's so stressful. What a huge decision to make, too. Oh. Anyway. Is it too late for her to apply to any in Florida? I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. Anyway. Um, oh, Jamie, wait. I'd love to see it. Did you tag me in it? Like, recently? Today? I'm scrolling, I'm scrolling. Oh my god, no way. Hang on, this is like the worst way to show you this, but... Hello? Are you kidding? No way. No way. <laughs> Add post to your story. <laughs> That's so cool. That's really cool. Wow, okay. Um... Thank you very much for drawing that. I don't, how do you have such artistic talent? I've never been able to draw. It, it's never been a thing that's come to me. I mean, despite all of my trying when I was a child, I really wanted to be good at drawing. I was never good at drawing. <laughs> it is a thing that I lack. You are very talented. That's so cool. That is really cool. Um, also, Luna and Abby, thank you for the resubs, both of you, by the way, too. Been doing it for so long, I'm 21. Yeah, but still... Loads of people have been drawing for a long time and are 21 and still aren't that good. Don't, don't. You give yourself credit for that one. <laughs> That's really cool. All right, we have to go on a warfare hunt. So let me just head off to do that this fine morning. Maybe I'll follow her and speed up a tiny bit because she's being a bit slow. B, this is not a mod. This is a real official Sims spinoff. It's not like The Sims 3. Um, this is a game called The Sims Medieval. It's a separate, separate game. Um, you can buy it on Origin. It's still for sale. It came out in 2011. It's a real Sims game. Do you know how often I have to answer that question? I'm telling you, everybody, everybody doesn't believe it's real. <laughs> Nobody thinks it's real. They're like, how could, there's no way it could be real. But it is. Well, I don't mean that there are unofficial Sims spinoffs, but what I mean it when I say it's an official Sims spinoff, I literally mean like this was made by EA. Like it's an actual spinoff. I think like people, a lot of people think that it's a mod and that like, I think that would be like an unofficial spinoff it was, if it was like modded. But it's real. It's official. It's like an actual <laughs> game. <laughs> that wasn't so bad. I'm not sure what those hunters are always complaining about. I should take a sliver of this meat and work it into my warfare badge while saving the rest for my cooking? Ew! You're gonna work a sliver of meat into a badge? You're weird, lady. You're really weird. Okay, I need to pay my taxes and I need to craft and deliver a crude plate mail. Where's my, um... My mailbox. Hello? Nah, I'll figure it out later. I'm going to go in and forge my badge. Hello, badge of warfare. Yummy. With meat in it. No, I don't think it was ever made on um, on console. Also, you don't need The Sims 3 for this game. It's, it's standalone. It's, it's not The Sims 3. This is a standalone separate spin-off game. I'm dead serious. Create some forge cooking. Huh. Mmm, just like grandma used to forge? Do I just have to forge something? Like, do I just have to cook something? Do I cook anything? Is that all? I have bear meat. That's my meat from hunting. Or do I have to for use the forge button? Forge cooking. Sorry, I got it. 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 This seems like a really odd choice. I won't lie. Ovens are for wimps. To the forge. Bestie, I don't think this is healthy. You're gonna eat that? Are you sure?
I don't know if that's the right choice. Really? Are you gonna eat it? Oh, no, oh, nope, you're peeing in a pot. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Finest forage cook I've ever seen. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, let's make the badge then. Also, someone asked if I'm playing in a different save than last time. No, so this game, um, you don't play with the same character the whole time. You go through like lots of different characters and lots of different quests around the whole place and they all interact with each other. So it kind of gets you to play with lots of different people. Um, it's not a different save or anything. Hurry up. <laughs> Landon, Nerdy, Steph, and Worm, and Madison, thank you all for the subs. I'm not sure if she ate it. I don't know. She didn't because she's still hungry. No, she definitely didn't eat it. That's good. Am I going to stream the new kit on Thursday? Um, it's a cast kit, so like, I don't really know what we would stream. <laughs> um, I, I'm, I'm going to make a video on it and maybe we'll test out some of the stuff in on stream, but I, I like it's a cast kit only, so like, you know. There, all seven badges are complete. To truly commemorate this occasion, I'll do one final forging to prove I've mastered all seven mechanical arts. But what should I forge? A hammer of unparalleled power from the seven badges, or the seal of the seven mechanical arts. An artifact of strong magical properties. Oh, magic power sounds better. We can do a- we, let's do a poll. Let's do a poll. Let's vote together. Or I could be a- I could have a hammer and I can smash people. There's really positives to both of these. It's un- I'm unsure of what to choose. I really don't know. Seal gives a legendary trait. Oh, does it really? Oh. Well, if the seal gives me a legendary trait. Oh, it's anyway, we're like overwhelming in perk in, in uh, favor of magic. 81% wants magic anyway. Okay, boom, we'll do it. That's fine. The seal will transform me as a person. Oh, she's making some snacks. That's good. Let's forge it. Seal of the mechanical arts. Okay. Okay. Come on, make it and make it faster. I'm not asking for much. I'm running out of time. I hope it's the last quest of the task. The last task of the quest. Oh my god, how long does it take you to forge this thing? Yes! Okay. Your sim has reached a point in their life in life where their fatal flaw can be evolved into a legendary trait. Choose one of the three legendary traits shown and then click accept to switch them out. Close this screen if you wish to retain your sim's fatal flaw. Oh, we made the right choice. We made the right choice. We made the right choice. Okay, guild connections. Sims with guild connections have an eye for clothing and decoration and they've got enough clout with the trade guild. They've got enough clout with the trade guilds to make all their fashion dreams come true satiated. Sims with a satiated trait have very efficient bodies and thus need to eat much less than other sims. Okay, that would actually be useful though. It would save me so much time having to cook less. That might, that might actually be like the, pro the good one. It's like in The Sims 4 when you get like the trait where you don't need to pee anymore. That's really smart. That's like kind of OP. Or industrious. These sims have got it made. Money flows into their pockets like a river flows into the sea. The question is what to do with all that cash? Give some back to the people or squeeze them dry. Oh, okay. Do I get more money? Do I have to eat less? This would save me a lot of time. I've not really found that I need money. Like, I think that money's easy to get anyway. Like, I don't really, like, I've never, like, been like, oh, no, I don't have enough money in this game. I feel like the food one is good because that's going to save me time if I want to keep playing with her, you know? Cause then I have to stop making the stupid gruel as much. I think that's better. I think time is, time is of the essence, right? Let's, yeah, let's do that. Quest completed. That's my first legendary trait for a sim. <laughs> 
Journeyman Smith Amber Jill was able to become a master of all seven of the mechanical arts, and she did it all without violating a single one of the rules that were loosely defined by herself. By meeting her own highly flexible criteria, <laughs> the blacksmith had truly earned every single badge that she had awarded to herself. Nobody could ever dispute Journeyman Smith Amber Jill's claim to the title, Ultimate Master of Everything. It was a good day for Amber Jill. <laughs> wow, what a really high honor of the reward that you have bestowed upon yourself. <laughs> so proud of you, ladies. So proud. So proud. <sighs> it's hard, Nicole and Howell and Roxanne and Maria and Meg. Thank you all for the resubs. That's so funny. Okay, anyway, let's pick a new quest. We got lots of options. Um... Oh, prelude to a plague. A wave of refugees had recently arrived in Simsyville, and with them came troubling reports of a terrible illness sweeping the countryside. As the last line of defense against the threat of a fatal epidemic, the responsibility fell a surgeon Mar Maribel to avoid the impending doom. Huh. It might be too real, but also maybe it's funny. I'm gonna pick it. Pandemic preparations. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Yikes! Um. <laughs> well, maybe, maybe we'll be prepared in Simsyville, okay? We, listen, listen. We have learned with our vast experience to prepare in advance. Okay? We learned our lesson, and now we're here to stop COVID-19. Or I maybe like, hmm. COVID-1532. <laughs> we need, first, we need to invent the mask and hand sanitizer. <laughs> Sweep the floor of the clinic. Okay. <laughs> I don't like it when little bits of dirt stick to the organs that I drop on the floor, neither do my patients. Excuse me? Okay, and also shopkeeper Kale. There seems to be a sudden swell in Simsyville's population. That means new sales. Better make sure I'm well stocked for their materi materialistic needs. Okay. I'll stock up then. Oh, Shopkeeper Kale's that guy I almost dated. Oh, it's too bad I picked the other one though. Check merchandise, that's easy. Looking up from the freshly swept floor, Surgeon Maribel found the usual numbers of ailing citizens packed in the clinic. However, on top of their typical groans of aches and pains was a palpable sense of panic. Right. Does that not count as checking the merchandise in the market stall? What more do I have to do for you? Oh no, I already did it, okay. I could do with a fresh supply of medicine from the clinic. Also, I need to catch up with the latest ongoings from town. Okay, that's easy. Listen to latest news from two people. All right. All right. Bestie, we need to invent soap first. Ah, you know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe that would be a good idea. <laughs> Have you all considered bathing? You know? Just an idea. Just an idea. Just throwing it out there. Thought it might be might be smart. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> Too bad we're four centuries off from germ theory. Oh no. Oh, or I'm thinking it's here too. 32 months. Oh my goodness. A blight that has consumed the countryside? What can this mean? Should I be scared? Yes. <laughs> Speaking from experience, my guy? Yes. All right. Well, I'm thinking about just going to. Oh, you already are asleep. Okay. I was going to say, I'm thinking about going to sleep. But. If we both just sleep through the night, we'll be all set for the morning. Oh, save the game, save the game, save the game. 
Aqua Bears, thanks for the six months. Um, oh, your dream started out with you in the tavern having a beverage. You called out for some music to liven the evening. Oddly enough, two famous bards appeared and started singing simultaneously. One, wordsmith Andy Island, sang a body and comically ironic tale of crude lust. The other, wait, okay, no. I don't like the idea of that. Is that how I'm gonna get that, like, Andy, I'm not getting enough action thingy? Because I don't want that. Adventure tale. What just happened? Oddly enough, rather than focus on a single song, multiple additional themes intruded into your dream. One would think a dream in featuring woohoo, pirates, cute scribes, highwaymen, and chalk would be fun, but in practice it just got confusing. <sighs> For a whole day? No! Don't make me do another one! Nah. He's having a really rough time. Okay, well, do you want to make some food? Let's go. Hurry up. Hurry up. I'm a former history major Sims lover too. <laughs> Hannah, you and I have a lot in common. <laughs> oh, that's my wife, by the way. I f it's good that she's actually staying here. So I haven't had good luck with that with the king. He doesn't, he doesn't sleep in the same bed as me. But at least, at least Maribel's wife sleeps here. That's kind of cute. She's actually there, my little clown wife, you know? <laughs> you know, <laughs> Ava Till, I hope you have fun. I think you'll like it. All right, once we finish eating this, I need to go downstairs because I have to start talking to the patients. I need to ask three patients how they're feeling, which shouldn't actually be that difficult, but you know, it's like a whole thing. The jester hat stays on in bed. <laughs> Fortunately, yes, it does. What's that? If I believe these wild reports, Simsyville is facing an unknown and deadly pandemic. This surely will test my ability. These weathered patients look panicked and the clinic is oddly busy for a warm spring day. This is a bad sign. Well, don't get near him. Stay away. Well, what do you need to do? Request supplies from caretaker Tegan. Oh, wait, I'm in the wrong place. I need to go... Discuss with him. Okay. And you, my friend, need to diagnose some patients. Diagnose the sickness? Okay. But what? Are you good? Getting scared. Oh, you're in good health. Okay. What about you? You have a disease too? Uh oh. This is not a good sign. Oh, there's a mask you can wear in, in hairstyles and casts? I forgot about that. No, I know what you're talking about. I will, um. I will put that on. Create two strong curative tonic and two strong health salve. Okay, health, health, health. Salve. Sorry, not salve. Well, you're still asleep? <sighs> Sorry, I'm going to put a mask on. This is my wedding outfit, so I probably should change anyway. <laughs> um, that was what I wore for my wedding. <laughs> I didn't mean to keep it on. Um, maybe I'll give myself like two different outfits. Oh, kind of love the vibes on that. Maybe I'll wear that instead. Wait, where is it? No, wait, look at me! Where did the other thing go? No, I like this. I like this. The Sim body in this game has more bones than The Sims 4 can physically support in its code. Yeah. 
Huh. Oh, look at me! Oh my god, I'm so cute. Are you kidding? Sorry, I'm just getting too distracted. I want to wear a little hat, though. I like this one. I don't know how appropriate that is for my, you know, being a doctor, but... Oh, you have to unlock the mask after it was a cheat. I kind of forgot I was looking for a mask, to be honest. She looks very realistic. Or you like this one with the long tail? We can wear this one. I kind of like that. Oh, you can wear eyeshadow? Oh, I can wear eyeliner? Huh. No, I don't, I think I'm too busy being a doctor to wear makeup. No, I think I look great. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to be a doctor. I'm gonna save the world. Oh, she peed, that's nice. Okay, you can go confer with that guy. Wait, where's... Request supplies. Where have you ended up? We're both going to talk to the same guy. Yeah, the pea pot is in the bedroom. It's, it's age appropriate, don't worry. Okay. I'm here to request supplies from you, my friend. Help me! Compliment garments. Request supplies. Oh, maybe you have the right idea. <laughs> maybe you have the right idea. Okay. What do you need to do? Craft those. Examine an ailing peasant. Let me go craft them. What does she want? Too strong curative tonic. Okay. Wait, craft item. Maybe I have the right stuff. Lord Leaf Angel Weed. Oh, shoot. Okay, besties. We have some work to do. It's time we get collecting. I don't have the right stuff. It won't be over here. We need to go to like the other areas. The Sims 2 Castaways? I've never played The Sims 2 Castaways. I don't even- do you know where I can get it? Like, do you know where I could get it these days? Some by the river that might help. I'd have a lot of fun with it. I bet I would have a lot of fun with it. Like, I totally- I totally believe you. I've heard so many good things. Um... There's probably ways. Interesting. I'll look into it. I'll look into it. Eaglewood? Okay. If I can just discover some more of these bushes. Sagewort. Mm. Oh, look at all this stuff down here we can get. Maybe I'll come down here and discover all of these. PS2 emulator. I don't really know how that works. I'll I'll look into it. Um Oh, Sasha has castaways for her sub goal right now. Oh, that's good. Yeah, maybe she knows then. That's actually a good sign cuz she might know. Lord Leaf. Is that what I needed? I don't remember what I needed. But anyway, I, I don't, I, I don't know how to play it. We need to look into that. Um, I botched the attempt a few times. Oh, shoot. Well, why did you do that? Come here. Can download it from, okay, I'll, I'll look into it later. I'll look into it later. Um, well, that's one right there. Do you think I have enough stuff? No. 
I need angel weed still, too. I need more of that Lord Leaf stuff anyway. And I also need two strong health salves. Okay, so what do you need for that? Angel weed. Yeah, so we need lots of angel weed still. Lots of angel weed, lots of Lord Leaf. By the training ground? Okay, that's good to know. Thank you for telling me that. Um, I will look over there. Collect that. I probably should stop speeding up so much. Um, the more we dig up, the better waffle will be. It could be anywhere. By the churches, too? Okay, that makes sense. Um, come on, we're just gonna discover everything. Off we go. There's nothing I need over here. Collect. 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 Wildflower seeds, blood moss. Wildflowers, blood moss. Failed to collect anything. I'm getting too, I think I'm getting too uncomfortable. I'm gonna have to go home soon. Yeah, Maribel, you gotta go home, bestie. You gotta go home, you suck. You're like actually sucking right now. Compliment the taste of two customers. I don't think that's gonna help me. I need to open market stall for business. Okay, I have to do that in the morning. That's a problem for another day. I've got too many things. Too many things to do. Sims 2 Castaway is not The Sims 2. Um, it's a spin-off of The Sims 2, so you, you, it doesn't work like the regular Sims 2. Um, it's different. I know it's kind of weird, but um, it's different. <laughs> All right, go to sleep. We try again in the morning. Got very confused thinking he was going to eat the cu- I mean, he could eat the customers if he wanted to. I shirked my responsibilities again. Cookie and Con and Patricia, thank you for the subs. These, like, these tasks are hard. Now I'm in a bad mood. I got pent-up anger. I need to find a victim to vent upon. Yikes. I'll do my tasks tomorrow, probably. I'll think about it. Oh, are you cooking? Can I snatch it from you? I don't think so. Honestly, I'm impressed that she woke up before me because she hasn't been doing that. What just happened? I think that was gross. Eat seed porridge. All right, and then physician, I need to go what? Examine ailing peasants. Friendly. How do I, what's the, do I just diagnose them? I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's check my merchandise over here. I assume we gotta put this stuff in there. And then open for business. Wow! That was exciting! <laughs> okay. Loved that so much. My wife might be sick. Oh, shoot. No, that's actually bad. Yellowed, clammy, skinny, swollen tongue, blistering fever, eyelid warts. Eww! Administer care to ailing citizen. I don't have any potions, so I can't. Oh, I gotta do my crafting. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Besties, we're not doing good. We're just not. Okay. If I can just get stuff from everywhere, that would be really good. Why are they smoking? Because they got the plague. We're not doing good. It's actually really bad. They're like all wildflowers. Forget it. Maybe I should just go up to the church like you said. I'm not getting like any of the stuff that I need. 
Well, I may as well try and discover things over here while I'm going. Just in case they're good. Alright. Up. Discover, discover, discover. Come on. Give me the good stuff. My chat said there was good stuff up here. I need it. It's urgent. Eaglewood blood moss. It's always Eaglewood and blood moss! Why is it nothing else? Ugh. Can go to town and buy stuff? Yeah, but last time I needed to buy stuff, they didn't have what I was looking for. There might be some up there. Let me just finish doing these. Angelwood is to the left of- okay, well. <laughs> I'm on the wrong side. <laughs> That's good. That's what we needed to know. And to the right of the castle? Okay, thank you. Well, if I get any. Besties. It's not there. Besties, this is not good. This is not good. No, it is not. Okay, well. Sometimes it's in the back area. Yeah, but... I don't see anything back there. You can't get over here. Yeah, I think the collecting quest- Angel Weed! Oh. That one must be the angel weed. Yeah, there's two of them. Okay, good. Yeesh. That's not it. We also need more than two of them, so. <laughs> oh. Do you think I'm doing enough collecting? We're gonna be here for a long time. All right, I've got- I've been told that it's around the training yard a few times too, so. Um. Let me look around a little. To be honest, I forget where she is. There we go. Let's come discover down here. No. Well, yeah, we're gonna have loads of seeds to eat. That's true. <laughs> that is true. We will have plenty of food. No, I'm not doing my responsibilities. You think I have time for this? I don't think I'll make it to pay my taxes in time. Is there like one of those... thingies over here? I don't think- I don't think I'll make it to pay my taxes in time even if I try. Because I only have an hour left. It closes at 9. Should I- Town Square has one? Yeah, but- Where? I'm lost, I'm lost, I'm lost, I'm lost, I'm lost. I'm lost, I'm lost. Oh, here we go. Run! Run, run, run! She won't run! Pay taxes! Oh, jeez. Okay. Well... I might be able to... You need to pay your taxes too, don't you? No, you don't. Ask two customers to buy. Well, I could probably do that. <sighs> it's too much work. Go home. I will have you be friendly. I can't handle two sims. I literally can't do all this. It's too much. It's too much for me. Killer Queen, Tada, and Simka, and Olive, and Seasick, and Dr. Deadworth. Dr. Deadworth, thank you all for the subs. 
Um, okay, well, I would like to ask you to buy my goods, so... Compliment taste. Do it, like, twice. Come on. Oh, I don't think she likes me. She thinks I'm boring? What is your problem, lady? <sighs> okay, you're gonna eat your little gruel. And then, honestly, I might see if I can craft those items. If it's red, it's not gonna work. I, I know that. <laughs> I can't even do it. All right, strong curative tonic. I can make at least one of them. It better not fail or else I will be very upset. Oh my God, I don't have enough to make anything else still. That's just one of them. After everything we've been through? Oh, this is not looking good. Um, yeah, Hannah, I know that eating good meals makes your sims have positive buffs. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> I have a lot of hours in this game now. Um, oh, if it fails, you still have the ingredients? Oh, do you really? I thought I was gonna take them, so that makes me feel better. Because I was worried it was gonna steal my stuff and ruin it. Um. But, anyway, Age and Fluster and Antler Queen, thank you for the subs. I know I shirked my responsibilities! Leave me alone! I know, I'll do better tomorrow, probably. Well, to the best of my ability, I'll do better tomorrow. Maybe. Come on, eat your little gruel. Make my little gruel and then eat it. Oh, here's some. Oh, wait, I thought I'd, sorry. Thought I didn't have any. All right, you little one. Need to make yourself a better snack. We're gonna have some seed porridge. Change the kettle to a bread oven. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't even know I could do that. And now you're backseating me about bread? I guess I'm rich now, so I probably could. Hmm. You make an interesting point. Um. You want me to delete that and get something new? Domestic, food and beverages, fireplace, beer cask. I don't know if they were lying or not. You're not being helpful. You're not being helpful. Oh, this thing. That's boring. And like way uglier. I still want the fireplace. This is boring. What are you- why? You're all lying! This? Okay. Sorry. Ah, flatbread. Look at me! Seriously, honestly did not know I could do that. This is the first time I've done this. No one ever talks to me about food in this game. T-Ray and Bio and Lauren, thank you for the subs, by the way. Um, okay, well, we need to get my stuff back. So, I guess maybe I would benefit from, like, instantly going over here and seeing... I don't know how many more I haven't, like, discovered yet, but I keep being told there's Angel Root over here. I did, you didn't see. 
Well, Amelia, when? Was I busy? <laughs> um, really use oven because it takes longer to cook in? Yeah, that makes sense to use it less because it takes longer. Um, you probably have the right idea. Um, angel weed only one? Ugh, it's not good enough. Where else can I get the angel weed? Past three streams. Well, Bestie, I can't read everything in chat. <laughs> you can't take that personally. You die. I don't know. I just didn't see it. <laughs> um, okay. Also, if it takes longer, then maybe it's not the right thing for me. Behind monastery near well. Are you talking about, like, back here? When you say behind monastery near well, because I, there's one village shop, uwu. Can you buy angel weed from the village shop? I'm probably going to go there and there won't be any. I'm, I'm going to speak to you from experience. I don't have high hopes. Okay, you need to pay your taxes and learn hot items and buy hot items. Okay. That's easy. Just outside the clearing near the forest, right outside the wall if you have it, on a small cliff to the left of the tavern, behind the monastery, to the right side. I have that. Um, behind the cathedral, on the side nearer to the monastery, around training yard, near a boulder, near two mineable rocks. Okay. Aha! This has got to be it. This has got to be it. Okay, I don't think they're gonna have it here, but we can look. We're looking for angel weed. Mm, grass weed, sage wart, nightshade. Yeah, besties, I think, um, I think not. It sounds like this will be what we're looking for though. Oh, I'm not the queen right now. I'm, um, I'm actually the doctor. Where else did she say? I got the one on the other side, on a small cliff to the left of the tavern. I don't think I've done that yet. Which one's the tavern? Not you. Is this the tavern? Oh, this might be it. All right, that's better. That's better. Let me go home and I'll see if I can do some more crafting. I probably still can't make them all, but we can do some. Medicate two people on operating table. Ooh. Oh boy. Also, you can come talk to me. But I want to see if I can craft one more of my... Oh, I still can't make it? I don't have enough Lord Leaf! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Well, I'm gonna treat some Sims for sicknesses. Just because I can. No, you can't be serious. Huh. This is my first time doing this. I didn't use my strong curative tonic, did I? Oh, this is easy. Treat someone else. Medicate Sim. Oh! Have two curative rum tonics in Sim's inventory. Yeah, that's easy too. Oh, these tasks are too much for me. I won't lie to you. It's a lot. Where can I find Lord Leaf? I don't know what it looks like. I forgot. Lord Leaf also grows near water locations. Okay. Let's see what this is. There's some in the shop. There was some in the shop. Should I really go all the way back? Let's go. 
It's bluish by the river. Okay, we can get some more too. We'll buy some and then we'll also get the stuff by the river. We'll discover this while I'm here. And this. Sure. Why not? We'll do it all. All right. We are looking for Lord Leaf. L M. There's two. Okay, that's good. That's good to know. Oh, I keep not letting that man talk to me. Oops. Well, I'm over here now, so. No. Lord Leaf. Okay, perfect. I got three of them. So now I have five more. That's good. That'll do it. That will be fine. Uh-oh. I'm about to get arrested for doing so poorly on my quest. No! I was gonna talk to her today! I just can't deal with two sims at once! That means she's gonna get arrested soon, too. Oh, we're doomed. We're doomed. We're doomed. Doomed, doomed, doomed! Okay, that's my strong curative tonic. Okay. I need to administer cure to an ailing citizen. Go, 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 go! Before I get yelled at. Why am I limping? Major bite? Oh my god, I got bit by something? Oh, shoot. This is actually bad. Okay, well, I saved him. Well, that didn't work. Now the patient has ooze dripping from those hideous eyelid warts. Okay. Well... Besties, tomorrow we have some work to do. Oh, M and A and Pecan and Kitten and Mel, thank you for the subs. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. You, my little friend, need to go straight to sleep. I haven't spoken to my wife in days. Bess, I, I think you might be new to medieval in general. There's no such introducing sims. There's no personality to said Sam. She's a surgeon. We're trying to solve a pandemic. That's all you need to know. <laughs> but don't worry. There's not- I mean, she has traits, but like... I don't have like a story. <laughs> She's a creative cook, a haggler, and cruel. If that helps. Okay. My guy, you are coming over here because we are going to talk to the surgeon. I need to start taking care of two Sims. I can't handle two Sims at once. It's too much for me. Come down here. He's gonna wait. He'll wait right here for you. Invite to cuddle. He didn't like it. Okay, that's fine. Wake up. All right. You need to befriend this woman so that we can talk to her. You're supposed to work on this together, so. What are you doing? Come on. Request additional medicine. We have bigger problems. The usual treatments are not working. Uh-oh. Request help from shopkeeper Pale. Oh. I'm not fo focused enough to request help right now. All right, that's not good. Yeah, I like these to pick bad traits too. You have to pick a, a weakness in this game. So like I'm two I have two good traits and one weakness. I really like that. I think it's kind of cool that you have to pick a bad trait. Like there's something kind of nice about that. Um Okay, I should be able to request help from him now. Still not focused enough to do this? Research symptoms for two hours. Are you serious? Oh my god, this game is too much work! It's too much work! You need to do it for 53 more minutes. Go. You can interact with a mirror to get more focused. 
I don't, do I have a mirror? I didn't think I had one. I'll be good now though. All right, let's talk to him. Request help. My life is so busy, shopkeeper Kale. I have citizens to heal, symptoms to research. Can you track down a certain ailing peasant for me? Check on the second ailing peasant. All right, let's go talk to him. You need to make more tonics and research the symptoms again. Oh, God. Does this count? I can yell at someone to get rid of the anger buff? Oh, that's a good idea. This is a new strain of incurable plague. No, surely not. Okay, well, I need to craft my tonics still. So next step, as we know, is to go down and get our stuff back. Um, I need to go, I'm lost, I'm lost, I'm lost. I need to go this way. Cause I need to come up here. I need this. And then I need to come. Is there, was there another one over there or am I forgetting? There's another one back here. I need to come get that one. And then I need to go over here. Up somewhere behind the bar is this thing. Go get those. And then we'll get some of this too. And then I should be able to make the other two things. I still need to craft two strong health salves. So hopefully I'll be able to do that. Okay, it's already 5 p.m. You need to keep checking on that second ailing peasant. Let's go queue up his things. Where is he? How far do I have to go? Okay. Nope. Craft item. Strong health salve. Do you think I have enough to make two things? Yeah, we are playing as the doctor. I think I've played most as the doctor and as the queen. Um, so the doctor is my like second most played character. Um, I successfully made one strong health salve. All right, let's make another strong health salve. Craft item. Second one. All right, finally, I've managed to catch this plague guy who's going all around the whole town. I need to get to know him a little bit so that I can ask him how he's feeling. Oh, I'm not focused enough to do this right now? Oh, well, in an hour, my bland meal thing will go away. Dangerously behind on quest. Okay, that's not my problem. Ah. Well... You also don't like me? This is a disaster. I keep... Seven minutes, seven minutes, come on. Go away, go away. I can't even do it. No wonder I'm so behind on my quest. I suck. I suck. Oh, Maribel finished her tasks. Okay, well... Sorry that you can hear Dan singing, by the way. Perhaps if I just go to sleep. Chat said if I get a mirror, he'll be happier. Are you saying I can... Oh, I can't put it in the bedroom? Oh, I'm on the wrong floor. Oh, that's why. Wait. Sorry, false alarm. I forget how this game works sometimes. <laughs> no, this'll be fine. This'll be fine. Gussy up. There we go. Maybe check yourself out. Yeah, you like that? Go ask that guy how he's feeling. We're going out late at night to do this because I want to get it over. Feeling a bit under the weather? Send ailing peasant to the clinic? What? 
Send to the clinic. So you've convinced me, Kale, I'll go. The sooner I see Surgeon Maribel, the sooner I can get back to my chores. Oh boy. Well, that's nice. I think this game's only on PC, yes. As far as I'm aware, it's only on PC. Um, came out in 2011, it's a Sims 3 spinoff, so I think it's only on PC. Uh, Beats and Bird and Finn, thank you all for the subs, by the way. Are you all asleep? Yeah, we are. Okay, good. Good. The chickens are keeping me awake. I don't like it. Meanwhile, Maribel's gonna wake up at 3 a.m. That's really unhelpful. Do you wanna make some food? Examine the second ailing patient. Well, may as well start. Let's diagnose him. Spicy is one of the turtles, yes, Maggie. I also think it's dumb. Pumpkin and spicy. It's less dumb when you know. Oh my. I mean, quite advanced stages of waxy, yellowing skin, fever, swollen tongue, puffy eyelid warts. I'm sure you're fine, but we should get you on the table to drain your blood just in case. This peasant's a goner for sure, unless I can drain enough blood. Okay, medicate the ailing peasant. Here we go. Um, drain Sim. Use a pile of leeches. Do you think it'll work? This peasant's a goner for sure, it said. Okay. Blood range needs to be near the gold before medicating. Oh, wow, we have to get it really down. Okay, medicate the sim. <gasps> Wait! You just completed full recovery for five points? The patient's been fully cured? Oh. Leeches are normally foolproof, but this time they didn't work at all. I need a large blood sample from this patient. Well... Sorry, you probably don't like this. Well, did I cure him or not? <laughs> Devise medical formula at a scribe table. Is that here? Also, you need to write two trade correspondences at a scribe table. That's a research table, never mind. I need to go to the castle, perhaps. Oh, you're not doing good. Okay, that's fine. You showed your responsibilities, you're having a dry spell, you had a bland meal, okay. But you can go gussy up! that make you feel happier? What if you check yourself out? Yeah? Okay, I have to go to the scribe table. You know what? I might, um, let's run to the castle. Make him pee too? Oh, good call. Good call. Here, buddy. Use that. Come on. You feeling good? You feeling good? All right. You, my friend, need to devise a medical formula. And while you do that, you can come meet me here because you also need to use this table. It can nullify the sickness using an infected sample. Then I will have a formula to heal the masses. Oh, if I can nullify, yeah, yeah, yeah. Craft one prototype antivirus. Oh my God, look at you, she's making vaccines. You're like a little scientist. Good job. Okay, you need to go home because we're gonna work on something else now. Um, come on. Come on, little sweetie. Let's see what we need to do that. Prototype, we need Valaroot and Blood Moss. Oh, that's easy, okay. That's like no problem. Okay. Administer it. Let's do it right now. And then maybe I'll try and collect some leeches. No, I fail.
No, I failed. The prototype serum only amplify. Ah! Oh my god, I killed him right there! I killed him! I killed him! Oh my god! I killed him! I'm not- I've got too much pent-up anger as well. I'm not even focused enough to- Oh god! Here. Use the bathroom. Gussy up in the queen's chambers. We need to be a little bit happier here, Maribel. Let's go. Can you talk to him now? No? You want to take a bath in the queen's chambers? Will that help you feel better? There you go. I killed him! Alright, I have to... Maybe I'll just wait for her to talk to me, and then I'll go write my second trade correspondence. I beg of you, shopkeeper Kale, find for me the infected peasant. Okay. Yeah, I'll find another one. I gotta write this, though. I need to pay my taxes. Besties, we are not doing good. We are not doing good. Not at all. Maribel, here. Yeah, I know I couldn't have avoided it. He was a goner. It even told me he was a goner, so it's okay. I do- I feel better knowing that. You know? Um, however, I do feel a bit bad. Because I- I am responsible for the- for the death of a patient. Alright, let's collect some leeches. Alright, and you can write that trade correspondence, my guy? What? I keep doing it and it doesn't work. Do I have to send them off or something and it's not telling me that part? I've done it like three times, it won't count me as writing the trade correspondence. Do I have to find the peasant first? Is that more important? Oh, we're having a little party over here? I'm gonna question this peasant though. Have I done anything unusual recently? Can't say that I have other than feel like the walking dead. That's pretty unusual. Cough. Before that, well, I finished off a spot of work in the village and then used the extra money to treat myself to some freshly baked sweets. <gasps> from fake from Baker Morris's shop? The baker! Somehow he's at the root of the epidemic. I shall question him. Uh-oh. You think the baker is poisoning them all? Came back from Dan's stream, heard you scream. Yeah, because I administered a cure to somebody and he died! I killed someone. Don't know about this plague business. I'm a busy woman and behind on my- I'm a busy woman and behind on my baking. I've not strayed from my normal routine. Tended the shop, made some deliveries, and purchased a bushel of grains. I used that for the weekly bread orders and gave leftover bits to my wife for brewing. Bribe Baker Morris to visit the clinic or convince Baker Morris to see Surgeon Maribel. I'm not gonna bribe you. Who do you think I am? Why would I bribe you? Why, you're gonna- you're gonna go see her on your own accord. You could be at fault for this. We're gonna be besties. And you're gonna stop trying to kill the townspeople. Kale learned that more- <laughs> Are you kidding? Well, no wonder he's starting a plague! <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> oh boy, compliment garments. Maybe I'll try and be a little bit romantic, see if that helps. I don't know if you like me though. Yeah, I can see it though. I can't. Oh, what's wrong with you? Ooh, what's going on here? <laughs> okay. <laughs> you can't leave. You can't leave. You have to go visit the clinic. I still say I feel just fine, but you make a strong case. If this plague is real, never let it be said that Baker Morris doesn't do his part for Simsyville. You know what? Baker Morris, you are a lot better than most of the people we know these days. I am off to the clinic, but if my sweet buns in the oven back home burn, you'll be hearing from my shop. You'll be hearing from me, shopkeeper Kale. Okay. I need to diagnose two Sims in the next hour. Run, 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 run. 
Okay, well, I did it. I did all my tasks. Next, I need to draw a blood sample from an ailing peasant. All right. Here we go. Did you not like that? You need to write some trade correspondence. Okay. I need to go to the castle. Because that's easiest for me. If you come write another trade correspondence, that would be great. No, I've done it like multiple times. It's glitched. There we go. Send trade correspondence. I already paid his taxes. This one wants me to ask two customers to buy, but that's not really going to happen today. Um, that's not a tax one, unfortunately. All right, what do you want me next? Await responses from foreign contacts. Okay, we can go home then. This is great. We're going to get a good night's sleep. I think this game's underrated too, Mermaid. I am having a lot of fun with it recently. It's a really fun time. Um, it's a good game. You think he's failing? Failing what? The tasks? The writing? Yeah, I think so too. I think because he's not doing so good. Uh, my bad? <laughs> that I will accept responsibility for. This game's just on origin. Um... Oh, Lady Mildred the Illustrious and Sergeant Maribel no longer friends? Uh-oh. I can no longer wait by idly, scanning the skies for a message of salvation? Uh-oh. Oh, shoot. A letter bearing the seal of trade in me fell in front of Shopkeeper Kale. Greetings, Shopkeeper Kale. Apologies, but I know nothing of this mysterious plague you mentioned in your inquiry. The only news I can share is that the incoming trade caravans have dwindled in the past few days. Traveling merchants mentioned a recent lack of surplus to be found. If you have any goods to deal, I would be open to favorable negotiations. Travel to the village to interview refugees. Okay, well, we'll have to do that in the morning. I'll just listen to my chickens and wait. I will just listen to my chickens and wait. I'm in a bad mood. I'm having a dry spell. I'm very hungry. I like to pee. Maybe I'll gussy up. Maybe I'll get, like... Some other, like, cute, you know, hygiene thing. Like, maybe I'll get, like, a thing to wash myself, you know? Like, maybe that would be good. I could probably benefit from that, to be honest with you. All right, to the village. Off we go. Still can't get over the dry spell? The dry spell happens too much. I need to find a, a partner. Oh, I'm friends with this Alexandria person. Um, hello. Um. I think you're dead. I do, I think you're dead. Okay. Took a few coins of persuasion, but the refugees spoke. All agreed on the vile symptoms of yellowish skin and mouth sores and the speed in which it killed. <laughs> As for the cause, some claimed it was a curse from the Watcher. Others said it began with a bite from a rabid rodent. One man swore it came about from drinking too much ale. Okay. Anyway. Dear Shopkeeper Kale, I hope this finds you well, given the current circumstances. We have recently been battling a, a virulent new plague caused by a shipment of corrupted grain. We are wary of any trades while our stocks are contaminated, but if you can deliver a bundle of wheat, we can provide a sample of the suspect grain. Ah, acquire 10 bundles of wheat. Now, there might still be some in the shop. So let's find out. Let's find out. Is it just gonna be called wheat? Yeah, I need 10. Maybe I'll just buy a loads. I probably shouldn't eat that though, but if I buy it out, maybe that would be good for the townspeople. 
Yeah, the baker mentioned grains, too. Um, yeah, if I buy it all out, maybe we would be um, better off. All right, Maribel, you need to have two curative rum tonics in your inventory and also give first aid to two people. Curative rum tonic needs- oh my god! What kind of stuff do you need to make? Maybe I won't do that one. Oh, here's Baker Norris. Let's apply first aid. I don't think he needs that. But we'll see. I don't know. This isn't The Sims 3. This is The Sims Medieval. Um, but it runs on The Sims 3's engine, so it, it looks like The Sims 3. You might recognize it a little bit because of that, but... It's not technically The Sims 3. Um, it's also like a separate game. Like you don't need The Sims 3 to play this. It's a completely separate, completely separate thing. All right, I'll have her do some more collecting. Honestly, if I went out and like got the good stuff while I wait for him, I would probably be like way better off. Um, we need to run around and collect stuff from over here, though. Because, like, down here in this town area, I'm gonna need this. Um, I'm gonna need this. Yeah, there's just dead people around. It's actually kind of concerning. Um, but I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure we'll get through this, besties. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. Oops, I didn't read that. Uh-oh. Probably should have. Well, I'm back! Trade negotiations with Craft Hole were successful in providing them with a fresh supply of wheat for a sample of the contaminated grain. I need to give Surgeon Maribel the infected stuff. Alright, you go home after that, and then I'll, I'll meet you there. That will be good. Help, I'm stuck. Help, I'm stuck. Help, I'm stuck. Help, I'm stuck. It's just up here, isn't it? Yeah. All right. Let's just go wait for her. Go here. Yeah, Merchant Kale's getting lucky, honestly. Um, I'm I'm really impressed that he's not dead yet. Like, the fact that he hasn't gotten sick truly is impressive. All right, you need to run! We're trying to fix the problem! God. Okay. I'm not focused enough to give you the grain sample. Well, it's not my fault. I'm having a dry spell. Oh, what about Donna? Should I date her? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. He's in too bad of a mood. He can't do anything. Let me try and get through my dry spell here. Maybe if I, if I woo this person. The fact that I'm literally trying to solve a plague. Oh, she doesn't like it. Can I go upstairs? Can I use like her stuff? Hang on, let me get some more stuff. This is for cleaning. Use that, wash in there, let's go. Are you feeling better? Here, gussy up. Get better, oh, I'm in the room while she's peeing. That doesn't seem right. Okay, I was able to negotiate a trade with Craft Hole for the rest of their infected grain. Here is a sample. There are crates of it in the ship. Collect what you need. While you create your concoction and figure out distribution to Simsyville at large, I will rid the village of its infected grain shipment. Okay. Burn the grain in the village. Oh. Well, this sucks. Burn the infected grain. Okay, you need to craft two batches of potent antivirus. Okay. Here we go. I made one. Let's make another. Thankfully, I already have all the stuff. Because I would have been stressed. Alright, I did it. I made two. Test on Baker Morris. Oh no! Do you think I'm gonna kill him? Do you think I'm gonna kill him? Oh, Gabriel, Whimsical, Allie, Jill, Chelsea, thank you for the subs. I need to have a higher relationship. Okay. 
the last time I tried to give someone an antivirus, I killed them literally instantly. So, you know what? Cross your fingers here, Baker Morris. I appreciate how brave you are, because, um, well, <laughs> I don't have a good track record. That's all I'm going to say. Not the baker. Anyone but the baker. All right. Open stall for business. Oh, maybe I'll do that. Here, wait. Can you do that? I need to do some of my responsibilities. Visit the village, figure out what people are buying and stock up. All right, let's learn the hot items. Investigate today's market. Okay. Anyway, sorry. I need to test this on Baker Morris, but we're still not close enough. Rough house, maybe? Get to know. Ask about religion. Banter. He thinks I'm being sociable. Oh, a whale ate his parents. Tell dramatic story, gossip. How close do you have to be with this guy to kill him? Oh, now I'm not focused enough to do it. Oh, shoot. I'm getting hungry. Okay, well, he should be there for a while. So we should be fine. I was very focused earlier, I'll have you know. But not anymore. Okay, now I can do it. It seemed to work? Oh, now to save Simsyville, I should medicate the well? Oh. Oh, I should probably go now, honestly. <laughs> Look at, uh, there's people dead on the floor. We need to go now. Okay, add antidote. There's people dead next to the well? Oh God. Yeah, we need to run, we need to run, like actually. The infected grain quickly flared up into a raging bonfire. Soon it was destroyed, and so was the virus that had thrived on it. Shopkeeper Kale had saved the village. Shopkeeper Kale had saved the village? I'm sorry? Who's the scientist? Who's the scientist that that made the medicine to save the town? He might have burned the infected wheat, but guess who figured out it was infected? Not another man stealing credit from women in- oh no, no. I'm gonna be real. I think I may send him to the pit. I- I think he may have to die for this. I am a level nine surgeon. <sighs> anyway, we saved the town all by ourselves. Kale just walked around. Should I place the mill? <laughs> Sorry, that's hilarious. <laughs> the, the fact that like, <laughs> uh, the fact that the, the wheat was what was the problem and then we place a mill. Okay, what shall we do? The sinister sorcerer? Wizards were funny. You never knew if they were going to turn a bunny into a bouquet of flowers or demand unequivocal surrender of your kingdom. Simsyville was under attack by one of the latter types of wizards. The wicked sorcerer claimed to have the power to destroy the entire kingdom. Someone would have to challenge him. Oh man, that's the one, that's the one. <gasps> Slay the sorcerer, slay the sorcerer, yeah! Shall I do it as the monarch? I might be puny, but I am great. A hero from Simsyville would step forward, discover the evil sorcerer's weakness, and destroy him! Oh, and the blacksmith can join me! Okay, cool! Oh boy. Anyway, Ella, Katie, <laughs> Tori, Small, and Cluster, and Gabriel Whimsical, thank you for the subs. War! Malice the vile, an evil sorcerer, has amassed an enormous army and is ravaging the land without mercy. <sighs> Malice commands his army from afar, safe in the upper spire of his tower, as his minions spread fear and destruction throughout the land. I love Lord of the Rings. 
Multiple kingdoms have united against him, and Simsyville has been sending soldiers to the front lines against his fearsome spirit army, which moves closer every day. If Malice is not stopped, he will spare no one from his cruelty. <laughs> Chaos! I am the queen, so I can send whoever I want to the pit beast this time. Good to know. Okay. Battle the sorcerer- no. Oh no. Oh, the first task is to battle the sorcerer's army. Besties, I'm gonna be real. This is not looking good for us. The battle against Malice the Vile raged on, and everyone was doing his or her part to try and stop the wizard. Hey, listen, bestie, this is why the, the pronoun there would have worked great there. Everyone was doing their part. It's so easy. I never understood this. This whole- people being like, him or her. You can just say they. <laughs> so much easier. You could have just done that there. It's 2011, though. <laughs> I feel like... No, this isn't the daughter. Um, this is the blacksmith. The daughter is not, like, in my household. I can't see her. Anyway. Regular day-to-day -day responsibilities had been put on hold so that all energy could be put toward thwarting the dire threat. Blacksmith Amber Jill was hard at work forging weapons and armor for Simsyville's soldiers, and had just received a shipment of Ferris from Tradeny. Meanwhile, Lady Mildred the Illustrious was headed toward the front lines for battle, but would soon need to find new soldiers to make up for their heavy losses. Oh, I'm doomed. How do I do it? Head toward the village to join the battle? Okay. It's 11.30. Nah, we can do that in the morning. <laughs> Go to sleep. You too, my guy. Feeling unrefined. Okay. What? What was that? What did you just do to me? I'm feeling a bit scared at the moment, I won't lie. Sleep in Maribel's bed. Oh, that's not my house. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Let me go home. <laughs> What just happened? Were they trying to diagnose me? Is that what? Oh, that's my husband, isn't it? Oh no, we're just courting him. Okay. Me and Buildmaster Garth are together. That's right. Um, anyway. Now we wait. <gasps> it's my kid! Princess Astrid! Can I plan Princess Astrid's outfits? Wake up. Oh my god, finally I can see her. I haven't seen her like this whole time. Let me do it. Please. I don't think it'll let me. I'll try and do it in the morning when she wakes up. I don't know how to wake her up. Oh, I can do it like this? Oh, cool. Wait, wake up. Quick. Before it goes away. Princess Astrid. There we go. Guys. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> what? Identical. Oh, that's weird. Okay, well, I'll keep her hair the same. I might give her a new outfit. I feel like I need to have something really formal because I'm the princess, you know? Can it be pink, though? Look at me! This is so funny. <laughs> I hadn't gotten a close-up of her face yet. I didn't know what she looked like, really. That's so weird! She looks just like me! <laughs> That's so funny! Oh, Alright, Astrid, here we go. 
exciting for her to be the queen. Oh, I will look forward to that day, that's for sure. Oh, you didn't sleep all the way through the night time, because I, I didn't, I was too busy with Asturd, I didn't finish it, but. We'll get there. Eliza Pancakes, B-Movie Lady, and now this kid, I know. <laughs> I do look a lot like a lot of them, huh? All right, I would like, honestly, I would like for someone to feed me. I'm sleeping until 10 a.m., that's not cool. Darla from Finding Nemo, that's true as well. Wake up. Come here. Feed me. I'm the queen. Yes, Lady Mildred the Illustrious. Whoa, a large boar stew? Oh, look at the whole gang's here! <laughs> that was kind of cute. Okay, sorry. Today, I need to battle the sorcerer's army, pass an edict, and hear three petitions. That's too much work. I'm just going to- I'm just going to battle. I should be fine, right? I mean, yeah. We'll be fine. Let me out! Help! Battle the sorcerer's army. Guys, no joke, this is not a good sign. Oh, maybe I'll save the game. I feel like I might die. <laughs> my sim is literally puny. Like, actually puny. That's my weakness, is that I'm puny. Look. Your sim often gets sore when using high-impact objects, lowering their mood. Your sim will lose fights more often. Your sim will lose king ball matches more often. Your sim gets drunk faster. So I'm serious? We're not doing good. Okay, I need to forge three battle things. Let's start. Gets what faster? Oh, sorry. Juiced. Juiced. Oh, yeah! It says drunk! <gasps> wow! They were different back then. What do they want? They wanted these. Let's make them. We don't get juice in this game. <laughs> we drink alcohol in Sims Medieval. <laughs> we drink alcohol in this game. Charging fearlessly into the enemy line, Lady Mildred the Illustrious was a whirling storm of death. Her battle cry led the forces of Simsyville forward and struck fear into the hearts of the enemy. Lady Mildred the Great, I mean illustrious, I'm illustrious now, not great, sorry. Vanquish 35 enemy soldiers? I killed 35 people? Whoa, I'm on a roll today. I am on a roll today. What do I need to do now? Battle the sorcerer's army and find three recruits for Simsyville's army? Okay, she's still battling, so as soon as it finishes, I think. We inflicted heavy casualties on our enemy this day. The forces of good will not give up. Girl boss! <laughs> I'll need to gather more recruits and get another shipment of armaments from the blacks before I go to battle again. Oh, look! 35 of 100 soldiers killed. My blade thirsts for victory. Wow. Huh. All right, this guy looks strong. Let's talk to him. <laughs> I have, I have to kill a hundred people? I already killed loads of people today. If you missed the beginning of the stream, I did a plague quest. And I, like, had to test some medicine on somebody, and he literally dropped dead instantly. Like, he was already sick with the plague, so he was gonna die anyway, but I tested my medicine on him. Dead. Dead on the floor, Grim Reaper appears. It was like that. It happened so fast. It was kind of scary. I feel a bit guilty, but, like, he was gonna die anyway. But... <laughs> You know, I did... Anyway. Blacksmith Amber Jill is one of the worst cooks in Simsyville. I once had her vegetable stew and it was disgusting. Why are you talking about Amber Jill like that? It's not her fault she can't cook! It's because she tried to use the forge to cook it, isn't it? She did that earlier. This aggression will not stand. I offer my blade to Simsyville's army. Okay. I need to make one more of these things. <laughs> this is absurd. All right, make another one. And then I will keep trying to get some more people. Oh, I got my bird out, okay. Take a screenshot of that, honestly. Nah, I don't want you on the army. Guard Morgan. I need some more girl bosses, honestly. Oh, I can't talk to her. Oh, cause she's guarding? That makes sense, she's busy. Keep girl bossing, that's fine. I I understand. 
Um, Woohoo with. I should invite my husband over here. All right. Anyway, any of these people look like I should. Armsman? Pirate? Let's try this guy. I can't. Honestly, I'm gonna come over here and see who I can talk to. Because once you stop fighting. Oh, here's a girl boss. Let's try this. <laughs> we do have an error, Emmy. You will be horrified to know that my heir looks exactly like me in real life. The little girl, the child that we had, it's like actually kind of scary. She literally looks like looks like me. There's a there's a link to the clip. It just happened like five minutes ago. She's me. It's it's like weird. I'm the heir to the throne. Okay. I've now, um, wait, are, did you not say yes? Excuse you? Oh, okay, I was gonna say, this aggression will not stand. I offer my blade to the... Oh, I need to have someone deliver them? Can I ask anyone to deliver them for me? Oh, I can ask you. I see. What's happening here? What? Forge three more. One hour remaining until next delivery of Ferris. Okay, do I have enough to make some more? No. Okay, we have to wait. I need to receive my... Here he comes. Let's get him. <laughs> Wendy, thanks for the bits. Also, Mia and Owen and Charlene, thank you so much. Um, all right. Oh, here it is! Here she is! Look, look, look! This is the princess. No, like, look at this for a second! Are you kidding? <laughs> I didn't even draw- I, her hair was just like that! And Cass is even more like me. It's really weird. It's like, actually weird. Have I received them yet? Fine, record. Yeah, retrieve them. Come on. Why won't you give me my stuff? Gimme, 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 gimme. Okay, I don't really want to recruit you. Maybe I'll recruit you to this guy. Oh, maybe I can't. Oh, I think I already did. Oh, never mind. Who else should I recruit? Guard Cassie? She might be good for my army. Is it gonna be me and like these three people? Is that like really where we're gonna go? Is, are we gonna do this with just us? Cause if so, this is not good. All right, make another one. Do I have to just keep forging them? Is that how this works? Recruit to army. All right, I've got all my recruits. Train someone on the training dummy for 15 minutes. Why am I doing this? What do I know? Spar with the recruit? Maybe I'll go home. I'll finish this tomorrow morning. I think I wanna get a new outfit for this. <laughs> King sakes for the 14 months. I'm just thinking like maybe I should get a second outfit. I don't know, it's just an idea. That was a romantic hug. No, that was a romantic hug. Okay, sea dog Jody. Praise her beauty. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she's kind of hot too. <gasps> no! Oh my god! She threw a <laughs> Date me, 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 date me think I'm being very alluring. Serenade? First kiss? Should we kiss? I don't know if I kissed. Oh well. 
It was fun for me, so. <laughs> I know I can date her tomorrow. That'll be great. Here, go to sleep for real. It's bedtime. Same with you. I didn't do anything I should have today. We're gonna have a bad mood tomorrow, but that's fine. Go to sleep. We got big stuff to do in the morning. <laughs> big stuff to do in the morning. I think I might have been courting someone else. Uh, yeah, I was courting um, that fashionista named Harvey. However, Sea Dog Jody is more appealing to me. Oh, don't worry, that's not the queen. The queen's married. Um, Amber Jill is also not single, but like, you know, whatever. Understandably confusing though. Amber Jill is the blacksmith. Lady Mildred the Illustrious is the queen. I have a husband, but I haven't seen him in weeks. I sort of thought that he and I had, you know, something special, but it doesn't really seem to have gone that way according to plan, so. You know, oh well. As soon as you wake up, I would like to plan your outfit, though. You've got, like, this great queen outfit. Oh, there's my husband! Anyway, you have this great queen outfit going on. We have a couple of them. I want to get something that's a little bit more, like... <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> no, I think I want to... I'm, I'm looking for pants, basically. I'm looking... Ooh, I hit my head on my own microphone. I think a pair of pants would be good. Although I do wear a lot of purple, so I think I want to switch it. Okay. Now, my friends. Tell me I don't look amazing. I look amazing. Let's go. It's not really purple, it's more magenta, but it'll work. Is my husband in here? I saw him for a second and then I lost him. Oh man. Well, it was nice knowing you. Look, I'm even cooking myself breakfast. Granted, it's a bad one, but whatever. I need to go spar with the recruit. This will be important. Get to work. Same with you. You need to get to work, too. We got stuff to forge. More of these. Come on. Get them going. Lady Mildred the Illustrious failed to draw water from the well. Okay, and that's my fault. How? Spar with the recruit. Monarch, spar. Let's do it. Look at me! Alright, careful with your swords. There's people here! Honestly, I feel like I might need this sparring practice more than her. Because I'm puny. I need to train someone again. Oh boy. Send the soldiers to the front lines of the battle. Oh, no. Send soldiers to battle. That's my husband, by the way. I have a- um, Oh, that's not my husband. That's the guild emissary. It's got my, rid of my tracker for some reason. I saw someone ask about it. And I did have one before. Quick, quit this. Alright, you need to forge some more. Um, this is some sort of war quest that we're doing right now. I don't know. It's serious, though. Make that. Let's go. They're ready for battle. I need to find three more recruits. Oh, maybe I'll go try and battle the sorcerer's army for a sec, though. Maybe just to see. How many more recruits do I have to get? Amanda, thanks for the thousand bits! Keegs, thanks for the 14 months again. And Megs, thank you for the four months. Talk with the 12 months! Um, been here with you all through thick or thin, through uggo mode, and the death pit. <laughs> oh, alright. We have to deliver some more of these. Charging fearlessly into the enemy line, Lady Mildred the Illustrious was a whirling storm of death. Her battle cry led the forces of Simseyville. Ah, oh, yes! The same as last time! I killed 35 more. 
Okay, I need to retrieve my stuff once I get out of battle. Thought it was a doctor? No, so, Bestie, you, you're more than one person in this. You kind of switch between, um, depending on the quest that you're doing. So right now I'm the queen and also the blacksmith. Today I've played as the queen, the blacksmith twice, and as the doctor. Um, okay, I need to find three more recruits. Tyson the villager? Probably not him. <laughs> I've got better options, I think. Um, Merchant Nicholas. Armswoman Jenna. There you go. That's the good stuff. That's what we need. I like her. <laughs> She's kind of hot. Alright. Keep chatting. Ask about religion. Are you willing to die for your queen? Hope so. Jenna is friendly. She's joined my army. Okay. Who else can I get? There's not a lot of people down here, to be honest. How about this sim? I always like gossip as one of my first choices. I feel like gossiping with the queen's probably not the best idea. Or at least gossiping as the queen isn't a good idea. But you certainly don't want to like... You know, you need to be careful what you say to her, you know? Oh. Mildred has improved as a monarch. She will gain more money per day and be more successful in profession interactions. A monarch is the sole ruler of the land. Oh! I'm on level 11, basically. It's only a 10 level thing, but I'm on a bonus level right now. So... Here, Daryl! Let's go! You're joining my- my army. Honestly, I might be able to do the next battle today. I'm serious. We could possibly get it done today. If I just- oh, he's cursed? Oh man, maybe I shouldn't pick him. Spar with the recruit. Oh. Fine. Monarch, spar, maybe I'll finish the task tomorrow. But yeah, we've never had money issues. I have like 20k. Oh look, I'm sparring with the hot one. It's Jenna. I like her. Train someone on the training dummy for 15 minutes. Maybe I'll go home. Honestly, I've done a lot of work today. Yeah, the monarchs barely spent like any money. I, I, I'm kind of thinking maybe I should try and buy some more stuff. Because I, I might be able to get, like, a better bed. Oh, wow. Yeah, let's get that. Duh. I have all these fancy bookshelves and stuff. I have so much money, I might as well. Oh, wait, I like that one better. Hang on, switch it back. <laughs> Whoa. These are my, like, chests, I think. Can I get, like, a pretty one? I already have a pretty one. Oh, never mind. That one can stay. That's fine. Um, how do you get end tables? Oh, this one's really fancy. Okay. Loving the vibes there. Wow. <laughs> I don't love the combo. I won't lie. I think it's kind of an odd choice. Oh. Huh. There's a lot of cool flooring in this game. I don't think I realize- look at- like, I don't think I've noticed. Huh. Well, can I get like a better- I'm 
probably spending too much. I need to like calm down, but I'm getting excited. Look at these like tapestries I have. What the heck? That's so ugly. Wow. Huh. I've not really seen like the build mode of this game. So this is kind of, oh wait, look at that. No, I love that. Okay. There's like miscellaneous floors. We got dirt floor, stone rubble, masonry. Wow. I should get something for Astrid. Yeah, in my mind, this is for Astrid, but I feel like she probably doesn't want it. <laughs> yeah, you can't, there's not like a build mode, build mode. Um, this whole game is basically like, um, oh, here's all professional stuff, interesting. But yeah, this whole game is, um, it's, it's like decorating inside stuff like this. Like there's not like a, a way to decorate like the outside of structures. Yeah, maybe I should get Astrid a better bed. I'm I'm kind of thinking that too. <gasps> no, the four poster bed, that's way better. Whoa. Okay, not loving the vibes on those to be honest. Especially now that I know I can move this stuff around better. And you can still alt place stuff. Anyway, we have like pretty things now, so not to brag, but like my house is fancy. There are toys kids interact with. Wait, how do you get them? Domestic children. Oh, look. Here, she can have this and I'll get her a better bed. She can have like a little four poster bed like we talked about. That doll is actually really scary. No joke. I don't really like her, but I'll put Astrid's bed like over here. Maybe straight in front of the door. I don't care. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. Oh, I've got some big spender points. Okay, well, what I wanted to do was write some laws. Um, got a bit distracted. Didn't do it. Might still have time though, so we'll try. That's one new law. Let's write a second new law. Cleared that, score. Okay, I actually did something. Now I just gotta train people on the training dummy. But that seems like a lot of work. Oh, I've got loads of stuff. Make some boiled something. <laughs> Yuki, cold freedom check. Thank you all for the subs. Can you make more rooms? Um, I don't. I don't know if you can or not. That one I don't know about. I'm not an expert. I'm not sure. Blacksmith Amber Jill has shirked her responsibilities. So, good work, Amber. Love that for you. Yeah, I think you're stuck with the layout they give you, like a dollhouse, basically. And you can, like, decorate inside the dollhouse, but you can't change outside of it. Yeah, you can call for food as the monarch apples, but um, I wasn't sure if they were going to be home today. I'm going to go the extra mile today and take on more responsibilities. Are you? Craft and deliver a crude longsword? I mean, maybe we could do that. I got the stuff for it. Maybe I will. What are you doing? Turn the upstairs kitchen in the castle into a kid's room because there's one downstairs too. Oh, that's smart. I like the idea of that. Um, I really should probably decorate better. I just find the, I find the build mode stuff in this game to be like a little bit unpleasant. Like the UI is not very good um, and I'm not very familiar with like the stuff in it. So I, I don't really like love 
doing it, you know? But we don't really need a separate bathroom. Like, that's the thing, too. Like, we could probably turn the bathroom into something else. Maybe next time we play, we can do some more, like, legit decorating, you know? And, like, actually make an effort with it. Because that could be cool. Um, yeah, but the thumbnails are, like, so tiny. And also, look at what I'm playing as. Like, my screen is this big because it makes it better for you to watch. But... My screen is teeny tiny. If I made it any bigger than the UI would get smaller, it's because my um, monitor, the resolution is too high. But if I made it any bigger, like, it would actually be... Did you eat my food? No, you're gonna make me new food. Anyway, um, it's teeny tiny. And it's, like, extra hard for me because I'm looking at such small stuff. Well, there's just one bathroom, but I don't mean, like, we should get a... We'll do it because I want another bathroom. I meant, like... Uh, I, I mean, I didn't mean, like, let's get rid of it because we don't need a bathroom. I meant, um, let's, like, move the bathroom stuff into a bedroom instead of having a separate bathroom. Does that make sense? Because you don't really need to have a separate one. Like, you can kind of do it all in one spot. Um, town square. But you can just put, like, the chamber pot and the tub together in the bedroom. I think that's kind of realistic, too. All right, we need to train someone on this. Let's do it. And there's two kitchens as well, yeah. Can you change your outfit into your armor? There we go. I love that much more. Spar with the recruit. Okay. And then maybe we could go to battle. I think we're probably getting ready. Yeah, other sims don't care when you do it either. That's the thing. So we could totally do that. Send the soldiers to the front lines of battle. Well, where are they? Oh, here they are. Send soldiers to battle. Wait, did I have to get new recruits because my old ones died? Oh, shoot. That's not good. But that makes sense. That would really make sense. Oh no. Amanda, people, cold freedom, thank you for the subs. Charging fearlessly into the enemy line, Lady Mildred the Great- Oh, here we go. Lady Mildred the Great, illustrious, sorry, I used to be great, so I just say it by default, was a whirling storm of death. Her battle cry led the forces of Simsyville forward and struck fear into the hearts of the enemy. Lady Mildred the Illustrious vanquished 35 enemy soldiers. <gasps> Uh-oh. Enough, I shall crush you myself. Prepare to meet your maker. Kill Malice the Vile? Execute by sword. Oh, shoot. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad for me. This is bad for me. Oh! Oh! How could you have defeated me? No! The Sinister Sorcerer. Under the guidance of the Watcher, Simsyville avoided yet another catastrophe, thanks to the strength of its heroes and the resilience of its citizens. The kingdom was able to survive one of the greatest tests it had ever faced. The evil sorcerer had been destroyed, and the threat was over. Score! Nice. Lighthouse? Should we put that? Love that, honestly. So cute. All right, what's next? <laughs> now what? Wizard tower? Oh, have I not placed the wizard tower yet? Why did I think I already did? Where do you put it? Wizard's tower. 60? Oh, we need to get way more. We need to get way more. Mm, don't want that one. Dangerous mines. As a kingdom grew, its subjects had to be governed more and more carefully. Some said an educated populace was the path to prosperity, but others warned that enlightened people could become difficult to control. How would the monarch of Simsyville manage the citizens' quest for knowledge? <laughs> Wait, maybe we should do that one. That one kind of intrigues me. Shut it down or encourage. Oh, 
Okay, to encourage the people of Simsyville struggled to better themselves, somebody in power would need to take the reins and ensure a bright future for, for a developing kingdom, or shut it down. A villager had started a school in town square, and that was a problem. Knowledge was power, and it had to be regulated. When people knew too many things, they would inevitably assume that they knew more than their ruler. This school would have to be stopped before it could undermine- Oh my god! Undermine the monarch's reign? I say we do a poll. Do I encourage or do I shut it down? On the war table, you can ally with other kingdoms and then do quests to annex those kingdoms. Oh, I should do that. Oh, it sounds like everybody's saying encourage. Everybody's saying encourage. Okay, fine. Not shopkeeper Kale again. Okay. Well, nice to see you, Grim. Nice to see you. Listen to the instructor's lesson in Town Square. Well, there's a poll, but I already picked it, so. <laughs> it's fine. 80% picked this one. Um. I don't really. I don't really see a lesson in Town Square. I won't lie. Maybe I'll just go home and I'll do it tomorrow. Because, like, do you see a lesson here? I don't. I don't. If you encourage it, you're going to regret it. Is that a spoiler? <laughs> that doesn't sound good. Okay. That does not sound good. Well... We'll find out. That's my first law. Let's write another one. Need to write a second law. All right. Oh, now I can listen to the lesson. Let's go back. I did one of my daily tasks though. Stinky, I can sing you a birthday song. Happy birthday. Uh, come on. I'm here to listen to you speak. And that's why puppy dog ears make the best glove lining? Take notes? There will be a test on this next week? Oh look, class, we have a special visitor today, Lady Mildred the Illustrious. To what do we owe the pleasure of your presence? This was a mistake. We've made a mistake. Should I chastise him for a horrible lesson? You're talking about puppy dog ears! You suck! My apologies, your majesty. I do the best with the limited resources I have. If only I had some help, my lessons could be so much more. I'll help. Thank you, my lady. I'm ever grateful. If I may make a humble request, the students would benefit greatly from a tour of the castle. Seeing how our land is run would be most educational from them. Okay. Well, let me go ask shopkeeper Kale for assistance. And then tomorrow I'll give the kids a, a tour of the castle. The kitties can come by. And we'll see them. I owe my current prosperity to proper schooling. I will gather the requisite supplies for a proper curriculum. Okay. Hey! <laughs> Welcome to the stream! Thank you for the raid! Oh no. You see, we just had to cut off a wizard's head, um, as I was trying to squash him and his army who were trying to kill me, and now, um, I have somewhat mistakenly decided to allow my peasants to go to school. So, that's the current, um, that's the current situation. <laughs> Welcome to the Sims Medieval! <laughs> okay, get three bottles of ink, sail to the secret library. Okay, how do you get bottles of ink? Do I just do it from the shops? I'll probably do that tomorrow. I need to pay my taxes. Let's do that. Anyway, hopefully you'll have fun with that. <laughs> Sims Medieval is too much. It really is too much. Um... Okay, sorry. I was just messaging Dan. <laughs> About dinner, in fact. <laughs> Alright, I paid my taxes. Did that count? Buddy! 
pay your taxes so I can get my thing for tomorrow. Okay, that's what I thought. Now go home. You two will go home. All right. Um, honestly, make yourself some food. I'm, I'm not opposed to that. We'll get some herring soup or something. It'll be great. And then we'll go to sleep. Look, it's my child. Interesting. And then he'll sleep too, because we'll, we'll deal with him in the shop in the morning. That seems fine to me. To me. Emmy, uh, Katriana, thank you for the subs. <sighs> All right, now we wait. I am displeased that I have to keep being the shopkeeper. I don't like him. I don't remember why, but there was like something about him that I didn't like. So, frankly, I'm upset. But we'll just keep on going. Oh, that's right! He took credit for solving the plague! <gasps> He's a misogynist is what he is. Oh, now I remember. I was gonna kill him. But then I got distracted and didn't do it in time and now I have to work with him. Okay. Go to the village shop. Let's do it. Sorry, my something is in my eye. To the pit! We can't even send him to the pit yet. It, like, doesn't let you send them to the pit when they're important to the quest. It's so annoying. Okay, I'm ready for the castle tour. It's 6 a.m. Oh, wait, what did we need? Wait, they needed something. Does anyone remember? Um. Honestly, I might buy some onions so I can eat while I'm here. Ink, that's right. There's not ink. How do you get ink then, if not here? There is ink, it's a blue bottle. Where? Oh, it's called bottle of ink. Oh, I was looking for the word ink, not the word bottle. Oh, there you go. Sorry, everybody. False alarm. I was looking for the word ink. That should be enough ink. Okay. I need to sail to the secret library. What the heck? All right. Let's go. All right. I'm ready for the castle tour. Come on down, kitties. Are you ready? I drew three buckets of water. Okay, I'm trying to get you to go on the castle tour. Excellent, your majesty, let's begin. Children, we are taking a field trip to the castle. I expect exemplary behavior. Follow me and stay close. Okay, well, let's go home. Are they gonna follow me? That's so cute. Okay. <laughs> Sail to the secret library. This is where Lady Mildred the Illustrious lives, children. Now remember, the dust on the floor here is worth more than your entire home. So don't touch anything, or you may find your family working off debt to Lady Mildred the Illustrious for generations. <laughs> oh. Next, we'll take a look at the reception hall. Come along, children. Chastity, get your finger out of your nose this instant. Oops, should have read that. I got an angry buff. Oh well. The kids are play fighting in here? This is bad. 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 This is the reception hall where Lady Mildred the Illustrious meets all the lords and ladies of the land and they have grand feasts where more food is thrown away than we're likely to see in a lifetime. Remember, Lady Mildred the Illustrious worked hard to earn all these luxuries. If you study hard, maybe someday you can be successful too. Pull yourself up by the bootstraps, kitties. Hunt and kill a great bear. Ask two citizens about life in Simsyville. Alright, I need to get Sims to join the school, apparently. That should be easy for me. Let's do that. And you need to deliver the ink. That's easy, too. She's literally a royal, though? Yeah, well, you know, she worked hard, but that's not why she's successful. I need withering the withering rose in at the village to catch some mice. Why 
What? I have to catch mice? That, I didn't realize we had a school now, that's so neat. I want to learn how to make my own water wheel when I grow up. I'm gonna build a whole city of water wheels. I'll call it Water Wheel City and I'll live there. I'll go join that class right away. Oh. Well, let me go talk to the other one. <laughs> that's really cute. <laughs> that's really cute. Alright, I need to catch five mice. Which one is the inn? I need to get some cheese. Alright, I need to get some cheese. Where's my kid? Oh, my kid doesn't need to go to school with these poor people. My kid is the queen. No, let's get some cheese. Go to the village shop and then I'll go at the shops. Sounds like the kid will only listen to her parents. Problem is, they're dead. How can I get her to listen to me? Wait, I've got it. Oh. I don't like the other kids. They tease me because both my parents died trying to catch a giant buzzard wasp for my birthday dinner. I wish my parents were still around. They always knew what to do. Except about the wasp. Have Suzanne the servant find a ghost costume. I'm sorry. You think it would be better if I found a ghost costume to like what scare the kid into going to school? What? All right, let's buy some cheese. How much cheese do you need? Honestly, I'll buy like five. Hunt mice. Go do it. Let's traumatize the kids into going to school. Yes, that's a great idea. That will really show them. Okay, can you find me? No, set a trap. Find me a ghost costume. Received one bag of mice? Oh, good. Do I have to keep doing it, like, over and over again? Oh. Oh, I'm gonna pretend to be your parents' ghosts? Oh, that's even worse! Wait, I suck! I'm not gonna scare her into school, I'm gonna pretend to be your dead parents? Who does that? Oh my god. Okay. I'm a bad person. Like, actually a bad person. Lower the mouse. I didn't get that. Maybe I did. I don't know. How many mice do I have? Set a trap. I got one bag of mice. I have three out of five caught. We're getting there. Acquire five eye patches. I don't want to do that. Why do you only choose girls to be your next heir in the legacy challenge? Bestie, I don't. <laughs> I don't. Usually it's like half and half. I don't know. <laughs> I, I just depends. Sometimes it's based on the Sims name. For example, I wanted Pepper to be the heir in the next one. So she will be. <laughs> it's not that deep. I need another cheese. Okay. I would like to get cheese. Lure mice. Alright, I need to talk to my servant again. I would like to get my ghost costume, thank you. Whoa! Suzanne? Here's your ghost costume. Don't ask. Are you good? I didn't get the mouse that time either. Oh, I keep flopping. No, I actually don't think she's good. I'm serious. I'm starting to get nervous. Okay, let's buy like some extra cheese this time. All right, ask about living in Simsyville. Do you have the cheese? You got the cheese. 
hunt mice. That's fine. Okay, well, I need to talk to someone else because in an hour that other responsibility expires. Let's go talk to this person. If I can just talk to two people. Lure the mouse. Okay, finally, I got all five of my mice. Just go home. I need to put on the ghost costume, but I'll, I'll do that in the morning. Everyone's gonna go to sleep for now. This is just too much. Are you ready to go home? Yeah, go home, make yourself some stuff. I don't know what you're making. Probably just plain gruel when I have stuff I could have made that was better, but whatever. No, no, wait, I want you to eat that. This mission is too much. Eat gruel. Oh, it's King Frogo! Okay. That's good. I don't see him much these days. <laughs> Uh, Lori and Lainey and Emmy, thank you again for the resubs, everybody. All right, well, yeah, I'll probably stream until 7 today. I probably could tone, turn slow mode off, too. Yeah, I'm gonna stream for, like, 20, 25 more minutes, probably. That is my plan. All right, now we just wait until the morning. No, I... I sort of keep forgetting to try, and also, we're married, so I don't really understand why he doesn't live with me. And also, it's kind of funny that he doesn't live with me, so now I don't care. Because, like, the other sim that I married, like, he- they moved in automatically. So, I don't really, like, understand why it is the way that it is. Because we- we got married. So, I thought that it was going to be automatic, but then it wasn't. I mean, he might live here, but... I don't- I haven't seen him. It might be because he's a king, like, of a different kingdom, technically, that it's, like, not gonna let me. Um, that is possible. Ghost costume. Let's wear it. What kind of ghost costume is that? Why do I, as the queen, have to do this? Can't I, like, send someone else? Think I can ask him to be with me? But everyone else I didn't have to. Ah, mom, you're a ghost. I'll do whatever you say. Just don't haunt me. What is wrong with me? That's like actually messed up. That's a child. All right, let's make something to eat. <laughs> Poor kid. Let's have some onion soup. Yeah, I also, I mean, to be fair, I never see my own child. That's a really good point. That's a really good point. I don't ever see my own child, and I live with them. I don't think he ate my onion soup. Here, eat the onion soup. Come on. Was that my child? I think the princess was in there for a second. I swear I saw her. Maybe it was a ghost. I don't know. Someone else ate it, and they ate it fast. All right, I need to deliver the bag of mice. So that's step one. And then I need to go back to the secret library again. Oh, geez. All right. Give bag of mice. Wait, did I come to the wrong place? I think I, oh, I should have gone to the other place first. Here's your mice. Now go to this location. Sorry, back and forth, back and forth. The children are going to be simply thrilled. I've been telling them we would be learning to juggle for a long time, and now we'll finally be able to do it. You're gonna juggle the mice that I caught? All of the mice that I spent time catching, and you're gonna juggle them. This game is too much. Board the ship. After boarding the ghost ship, the ethereal captain glided up to you and your first mate and grimly asked, Are you the Watcher? Um, no, your first mate replied. This did not go over well with the ghost crew. In fact, they hurled lightning and slime at you. Slimy lightning. While hightailing it back to your ship, you yelled at your first mate. If someone asks you if you're the Watcher, say yes. I got a slimed 
buff. And I'm having a dry spell again. Okay, cool. I've got the book, and they've got their bookworm poison. All is right with the world. Now to bring this to the instructor. Okay. Deliver the book. This is too much. Too much, I tell you. I might, I might try and get Alexandria to date me. I feel like that might be a good thing to do with my spare time here. Because I'm having- Oh, look at the kids playing! But I'm, I'm having this whole dry spell thing. Let me go tell Lady Miller about school supplies. But if I could find my, my little girlfriend, that would be great. Excellent work! I'll see if Clifton has any other needs. Okay. Turn Sim Marker on. Cuddle on bed? Woohoo? Oh, are we married? What? Oh, I might be getting my action. Hang on. I might be getting my action. Turns out I might be married to her. It's really unclear. Praise her beauty. Romantic hug? Bestow favor? Hold hands? I may be able to convince her. Oh, she's in a relationship with Jeffrey? Oh, then why did I say I could woohoo with her? Well, now she's gonna be in a relationship with me. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Bad, 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 bad. First kiss. She thinks I'm being very alluring. Oh my god, I'm a scammer! We're romantic interests with each other? Woohoo? No way. And you can get pregnant from this? Oh, I don't think she's gonna woohoo with me. I have a single bed. Wow, okay! Yeah, I don't think that her boyfriend's gonna like that. But that's not my problem. Um, what are you gonna do? Oh, hi, Dad, by the way. <laughs> Did my dad type in the chat? Why is everyone saying sup? I just assumed, but maybe not. Hard to say. I didn't even see it. Alright, it's a bit late for this. He said action. What does that mean? Your Majesty, there's only one more thing that you could do to ensure a strong future for education in our kingdom. Write a new law requiring part of the taxes you collect to be used for the schooling of our children! Oh man, you want me to spend my tax money on you? I have to invest back in the community instead of just into myself? Well, this sucks! Why should I have to do that? Sign a royal arrest warrant. Send guildsmen to the stocks. Do I have to go talk to him for this? Why can't someone else do this? Okay, back home. And then tomorrow I'll deal with my laws. Just tax them more? Yeah. <laughs> Just tax them more. That'll fix it. <sighs> Alright. To bed we go. It's 2 a.m. I could have passed out from that. That would have been bad. Save the game. Yeah, I'm still dressed as a ghost. I should probably take my... It's fine. I kind of like it. Alright, well... Now we just wait until the morning so I can write a law ensuring available resources for non-idiots. <gasps> what the heck? This game? <laughs> yeah, that poor kid's gonna be, like, traumatized. She's gonna keep seeing her ghost mom everywhere. Okay, I'm getting my food. I'm feeling pretty good about this. Onion soup. Thank you. I probably should, like, talk to my servant some more. Maybe later today I'll deal with that. Um, 
Maybe over here, should I like view the political situation or something? I haven't done this in a while. Nah, let's write a law. Write a law ensuring resources for schooling. Oh, it's done? Oh. I'm like bonus levels three. I'm like 13, level 13. And Kale is a merchant level four, so that's good. We're doing all right for ourselves. <laughs> okay. We'll get a wizard's tower soon enough. It'll be great fun. Assassinate the queen now? I don't think I want to. Do I even have that option? No, I don't think I have that option right now. Unless there's... It is the incident. Oh. I think the quest expired. I think the quest might have expired too. You can re-roll or show all the quests. Yeah, so we can get it. We can we can do it, like, later. Oh, we only have seven available quest points. Uh-oh. What does that mean? I can only do, like, two more quests before I start a new town. Oh. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. So then we start over. When you finish, you can either free play or start a new kingdom, if I remember correctly. Oh, okay. All right. We'll keep that in mind. Maybe we'll wait until the next time we stream this to start something new again then. And it'll have like specific goals. Oh, okay. Okay. That makes sense to me. This is like the tutorial kingdom. All right. I got, I got you. I got you. That makes sense. So the future ones will be better. Okay. Also, Bruin, thanks for the 49 month resub, by the way. Hello. And Drowsy, thank you for 11 months. Um... We're very high security, very low culture, very high knowledge, neutral well-being. Huh. Okay, so we'll stream Seems Medieval again, honestly, like, wait, what's happening next Tuesday? I mean, like, next Monday or Tuesday- oh, wait, no, oh, hang on. We're doing a shell challenge next Monday, so we probably won't be ready. Maybe next Thursday we'll do- Sims Medieval. I'm looking at my schedule because I was going to start a shell challenge on Monday, so I'll probably need two days to do it. So I'll probably need Monday and Tuesday to do the shell challenge. Um, we can play Sims Medieval on Thursday next week. All right. We've got a lot going on right now. <laughs> but we're planning, to, I wanted to do a shell challenge next week, so we have to um, probably take two days to do that. Usually it does. So, I mean, we might finish it really fast. Who knows? But it might take us two days, so let's pretend that it will. Um, having something on low effects around in the town? Yeah, I didn't realize my culture was so low. I probably should work on that. That's interesting. Well, that's good to know. <laughs> that's good to know. Anyway, we're gonna do a shell on, um, on Monday of next week. My actual plans for the rest of this week, though, um, so tomorrow, we stream in the mornings on Wednesday, so we'll stream tomorrow morning. Um, we'll stream tomorrow morning and we're gonna play Animal Crossing. Uh, on Thursday, we're playing with the Potts family, my, like, Sims 4 Legacy Challenge. On Friday, we're gonna do some villager hunting in Animal Crossing. On Saturday, we have, like, a special collab planned with two of my friends. Um, we're gonna do a stream with Momo, Misfortune, and Candidly Kayla. Um, I have, like, some ideas for, like, a sort of challenge kind of vibe. Um, but that we're gonna do, like, a collab on Saturday. It'll be really fun. Um, and also on Sunday, it's Rick Astley's birthday. <laughs> so, um, we're gonna do a baking stream on Sunday. My plan is to make a bunch of Rick rolls. Like, I'm gonna make, like, bread, like, bread rolls. I'm gonna make, uh, cinnamon rolls. And I'm gonna make a Swiss roll. It's gonna take me a long time. I might regret this. I also have not picked recipes. But, that is my plan for this weekend. <laughs> It should be fun. Um, I'm kind of excited about it, to be honest with you. So, I might I might get off stream like 10 minutes early if that's good with you all. Because um, I, I don't know. I'm, f I'm feeling like... 
I'm feeling like I want to lay down, truth be told. <laughs> Dina, thank you for the 10 months. Um, but I, we made a lot of progress in Sims Medieval today. And I'll see you tomorrow morning. Um, tomorrow morning we get to work more on my Animal Crossing Island, which I'm excited about because we've been doing so much terraforming, so. I love Sims Medieval. Something about Sims Medieval is just, it's great fun. It really is so much fun. It's so dumb. And I feel like we've like barely, barely scratched the surface almost, you know? So I'm kind of excited to, to do more of them. It's kind of exciting. <laughs> um, but anyway, <laughs> I hope that you all had a good night. I want to go see who all is live right now. Um, uh, let me see, 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 let me see. Um, I want to raid someone who's playing Sims. I raided Kayla yesterday. I probably shouldn't raid her again, huh? <laughs> my fr I like, I opened up my Twitch and I was like, oh, candidly, Kayla. And then I was like, Kayla, you can't raid other Kayla every day. <laughs> you can't, you can't raid Kayla every day. That's too much. <laughs> you can't just keep raiding Kayla. <laughs> um, okay, okay, okay. Let me go see. Maybe, do you know what? We haven't raided Maggie in a while. Let's go raid Equippy. Um, Maggie's playing Sam's. You have a thought? Oh, what was your thought, Christine? Maybe we can do your thought tomorrow. Oh, that maybe that was your thought. Either way, Maggie's playing The Sims 4, um, doing the career legacy challenge, which is always a fun one. Um, your thought was Maggie? Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> Anyway, um, thank you all for hanging out tonight. I, I really had a good time. I needed this today. It's just fun to play Sims Medieval. It's fun to just hang out. And I hope that you liked it. If this is your first time seeing it, um, I know it's like so dumb. So <laughs> I hope that you liked it. I feel like I really enjoy not even just playing, but also like seeing people's reactions to Sims Medieval is really amusing to me. Like the way they come in and they're like, is this a mod? <laughs> And I get to be like, no, it's not a mod. It's a real official Sims game. It's a spinoff. <laughs> but I really, I really love it when people are like, what is that? I have never heard of this. I think it's kind of fun. So anyway, have a great night, everyone. Um, and I'll catch you tomorrow morning, okay? Yeah? Say hi to Maggie for me. Okay, okay. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. And stop.